Hello, hello, and welcome back to another episode of Modded Minecraft with me, Band Nerd Mama, on Minecraft Java Edition 1.20.6. Today, I have two things that I want to get accomplished. The first being a mob farm, and the second being um, a tunnel to the mob farm. Now, I have scouted out a location where I want to put the mob farm, and I have actually dug the tunnel, but I haven't decorated it at all. So, here you can see my waypoint mob farm, and here is the path to it. It is a few hundred blocks away, which is why I made the tunnel so we could go straight there. So I have decorated this part of the tunnel, but then the rest of it is just empty. It's gonna be an ice track for boats. So I can go zoom zoom to get out there. I need silk touch. But in order to get silk touch, I need to enchant. And in order to enchant, I need levels. And you can see, wow, I'm at 20 levels, man. I got stuck in a death loop yesterday, and so I was down to like no levels. I had one. Oh no, I didn't bring all the things I needed. Darn it. A few moments later. Okay, so we're back at the mob farm location. I'm just gonna build the simple default type mob farm. Um, I still don't have all of the things I'll need for it because I didn't bring trap doors or anything like that. Okay, so I'm going to need to move this chest because I put it right in the middle. Actually, I built the platform with the chest in the middle, apparently. Okay, let's move that. Let's move that. No way I can hold all of that. But I can hold a lot of it. Okay, that actually went a lot better than I thought it would. Nothing fell in the ocean. Okay, so let's pick some of these stone bricks, or not stone bricks, but deep slate stone bricks, and let's mark out our tunnels up and down. So boop, 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 and boop, boop. Okay, so I'm gonna go up 128 blocks. One, two, Okay, I'm, I'm going to go up to Y191, so I've got just over, or just under 100 blocks to go still. Five more blocks. One block. Okay, now I am at Y191. We need a torch, and we need a platform. Okay, um, I'm going to go down and set my spawn because this is 128 blocks up. Okay, and then I'm gonna put all my stuff away. I'm gonna lose all my levels, but you know, whatever. Because I'm probably gonna die about halfway up. I don't have respiration or anything on any of my armor. I'm going to lose my 20 levels, but this is an XP farm, or at least it will be, so. This is bad. I'm losing full hearts. Oh boy. Oh no. Oh no. So close to the top. That is trippy. Okay. Blip. Nope. Blip. Up I go. I only drowned once. Yay! That actually makes me super excited because yesterday I drowned like seven times in a row. It was bad. Okay. How did I end up with one extra? That's weird. I don't I don't need the one extra. How how did 
did that happen? Hello from future BNM. This part of the video is being recorded in October of 2024, about four months after the previous video was recorded. Um, and I'm here to let you know that, well, unfortunately, I deleted the replay video of me actually building the mob farm. So unfortunately, there is no time lapse which is quite unfortunate. And as you can see, this is my current mob farm updated beyond what you're about to see in the video. Please enjoy this montage of me using the mob farm and then consequently enchanting things after I've used the mob farm. Thank you. All right, and we're back. The mob farm is complete. And this is what it looks like. Oh, it's raining, but I'm protected from the rain because of the mob farm. So that's what it looks like from below. And if we free cam a little bit, here's what it looks like from, oh, I made a little mistake, but otherwise this is what it looks like from above. And as you can see, it is working quite well. I have set up spider proofing. These are trap doors, so spiders don't spawn. Um, I don't know why mobs are only spawning on the top and not the bottom. I didn't do anything different, but so here we are. Let's get some levels, shall we? All right, I'm already at 11 levels. Let's fix our pick because the pickaxe needs a little love. Um, it has one third the durability that it should have. So we are just going to stand here and harvest mobs. Yay, I have a way to repair my stuff once I have mending books. And also a way to get um, XP now. So I've got my chests over here. Look at that. I've already got a little over a quarter stack of gunpowder. None of my gear is enchanted except for this pick. And so I want to get all the levels and see what kind of enchants I can get. Uh, from the enchanting table before I start adding books to it. Oh, that sounded scary. Okay, I do not want to get that close to them because then they can see me. Good to know. Okay, I'm going to mute and I am going to chop at these guys until my pick is fully mended and I'm at 40 levels. Let's see what happens. The next day. All right, so here I am trying to get that silk touch that I need in order to make my boat highway. I can't get ice without silk touch. Unfortunately, I'm having a tough time until finally I get fortune, which is not silk touch, but it'll work. All right, and with this mending book, that's one pick down, one to go. Still need that silk touch though, so I'm gonna make another pick and try enchanting that one. Okay, so why am I in creative mode? Um, I do have hacks. I am opt on this server. It's my world. I could do what I want, but also I didn't feel like dying when I went in to fix the mob farm. That's all.
And now with the enchanting set up in a much better place right next to the XP farm, I am going to finish enchanting all my gear. And that's going to do it for today, folks. Thank you for watching today's episode. I hope you enjoyed it. If you did, please leave a like. And if you enjoy my content, please consider subscribing. And I will see you next time.